something has gone wrong with this Rocon. Whenever you turn one tire, both tires should turn. So this tells us something in the drivetrain, a gearbox, something has gone bad. In our case, it's a roll pin. These roll pins are designed as a fail safe in the system so that when something gets over torqued, these will actually snap and spin off, relieving the pressure from the gearbox and the other drivetrain components. These are like a dollar to buy. Uh, they're easy to change on the trail. It just takes a few minutes. So in this particular case uh, where this roll pin is located, all we've got to do is take the seat off and then that front sprocket for the rear tire, there's a cover on it. We're just going to take that off and then that exposes the sprocket and the chain. And as we turn that, you can see the roll pin hanging out there. And there's no hole going through the shaft, which tells us the shaft has spun inside the sprocket. So all we've got to do is hit it from a different angle, see what we can find. As we look through there, we can see a little piece of the old pin in there. That's not a big deal. That'll just push out with the new pin as it goes in. So what you do is you get a pair of pliers and put your hand in front of the camera so nobody can see what you're doing. Pull the old one out and then just work to make sure you line those up really nice so that as the new pin goes in, it finds its way through there and pushes the old pin right out. Once you've got the sprocket lined up with the shaft, make sure to find the absolute worst slow motion footage you can find and tap that pin in with a special hammer. And then get a rubber mallet and a punch and drive that pin all the way through the sprocket and into the shaft, making sure to mount your camera to the bike so the viewing experience is just as terrible as possible. When that's done, turn the rear tire in this case and you'll see the old pin pushed out. Take that, put it under your pillow, and you'll find a dollar in the morning. Now this Rocon is working how it should, two wheel drive. This Rocon should be able to go anywhere you want it to go now. There are other roll pins all throughout the drivetrain system, so look through these inspection holes if that particular one isn't the case on your bike. Push the old pin out, replace it with a new one, and you'll be back on the road in no time. So once we're done, we're just going to put the bike back on the ground, make sure that the tire pressure is equal in the front and back tire, and then we're no longer sad with a one-wheel drive motorcycle, but we've got a two-wheel drive Rocon that will take us almost anywhere we point it.